Vanilla.com, the Thomas Picayune, Jared Roser here at Calvary Baptist with Rodarius Lili Williams. You've been committed to Oklahoma State. We were just talking about for quite some time. But uh, a lot of other schools aren't necessarily giving up on you just yet. Mississippi yeah, State was one that's that's been interested. And you said also Arizona. What, I mean, what, how much have you heard from some of those other schools and and uh, how much are you thinking about what they have to say? Yeah, I'm still, you know, open just listening to what other schools got to say, but I'm I'm pretty much solid on Oklahoma State right now. What – um. And I'm, I'm sure Oklahoma State coaches are still talking to you quite a yes, bit. Sir. What are some of the things that, as signing day nears, you hear from the folks up there in Stillwater? And and I guess how do you feel about the way their season went overall? I think, you know, they had a pretty good season. And it made me even, you know, be more even solid. And the, the people up there are just telling me, you know, stay committed. You know, they need me and they would love to have me. You know, we had our quarterback decommit. So they, now they're kind of, you know, worried about me. But I'm telling them I'm solid, so. I'm going to stick to my word. Um, as far as y'all's senior year, didn't get as far as y'all had the previous couple years, but obviously still had a really strong season, uh, particularly when a lot of folks got real critical and doubtful of y'all when Shea left. Yeah. How did you guys feel about that last run, uh, just overall, that the nice season, making making a little playoff push, even though it ended a, l a little bit earlier than you would have liked? Well, when um when Shea left, it was kind of like man, everybody was like down on themselves, you know, thinking we didn't have a chance, you know. So, as seniors, we had you know came together and told the team, you know, we're gonna be good. Jake Barley had to step up, you know, and fill Shea's role, which was a tough role, but he did it. Being an um, athlete that he is, and he led us, but not as far as we wanted to go. But I think he did a pretty good job, and we ended well. For folks that. You know, Oklahoma State fans that maybe got excited when you committed, looked into you a little bit, stuff like yeah. that, maybe saw some film. Being that it's been a little while, what's the biggest growth or change or anything from you from from then through now the end of your, your high school career? What have been some of the things you've learned or adjusted or, or just picked up along the way or improved upon? Yeah, I improved upon, you know, my skills, you know, because, you know, in high school, you know, it's pretty much everybody the same. But once you get to the next level, you know, people are going to be faster and bigger than you. So I have to train myself mentally and physically, you know, to be prepared. You know, the coach is telling me, you know, I got to come come in ready because I have kids that's coming in at 2016 just as ranked as I am. So I got to be ready. And I have people that's there already in my class that's graduated early. So I'm basically, you know, kind of behind a little bit. So I have to, you know, motivate myself to work and, you know, be prepared when I get there. With as hectic, I guess, as, as the recruiting process can be, what do you think about going, I mean, as now sign day approaches, what is it going to be like to wrap some of that stuff up and make everything official? I think it's going to be, you know, pretty easy. You know, I'm already, you know, solid. So I think it's going to be a pretty, pretty easy task. Emotional day? No? Pretty much for the family. Yeah. yeah. Especially with uh, Greedy just walked in. What's it going to be like to have both of you guys be able to sign and go to Division One on the same day? I think it's going to be tough, you know, being away from my brother and knowing that I've been with my whole life. I think it's going to be a big challenge for us just to be away from each other. There you go. Rodarius Lili Williams over at Calvary Baptist. Noel.com, the Tom Spicky and Jared Rosen.